nice to see you. This is the first episode of Exploring LA. Today, Alison and me are gonna explore Hollywood for you. Hey everybody, we're on Sunset Boulevard right now. We're gonna show you around town. Yes, we are on legendary Sunset Boulevard. Guys, this is one of the coolest comedy clubs in LA, Upright Citizen Brigade. Katie, you need to perform here. Yes! <laughs> Let's make that happen. And shall we show we have already the necessary glamour for that? We show you our glitter eyes. Can you see that? That's where we're gonna go, guys! I cannot believe they just talked about us on the tour bus. I just heard the guys say there's Allison Melavid Cohen and Katie's Crazy Diaries. How cool is that? This is super cool, guys. Awesome. We're famous. We're famous in Hollywood. <laughs> look, look, they are taking pictures of us. <laughs> Can you see that? I oh, fuck, I should take off my scarf, but we don't have time for that. Can you wave to us? <laughs> Could you wave? Oh, yes. Yes, my friend. Thank Hello. you so much. Hi. Thank you, guys. Yes, we're famous. Where can we see you? Where can we Katie's see? Crazy Diary. YouTube, Katie's Crazy Diary. Who's Crazy Diary? Katie's Crazy Diary. K-A-T-I. Crazy Diary, all right. Thank you. <laughs> guys, that's how you get famous in Hollywood. That's how easy it is. Boulevard, guys. Just let you know. Yeah, guys, we're standing in front of the Sunset Gower Studios, like more on the other side because they didn't allow us to film right in front of them. But can you see it? Yeah. You know, I did some research about five minutes ago <laughs> about it, and I learned a few things. Three of my favorite shows were filmed there. They filmed Married with Children. They filmed the first four seasons of The Golden Girls. It's one of Katie's favorite I'm shows I'm such too. a big fan of Betty White. And did you know that Betty White started out with music TV too? That's so cool. She did. She was the first music TV host. I didn't even see that. That's awesome. Yes. Yeah, and Facts of Life. It was, it was built in 1912, so over 100 years now. And there's not a floor 13. Hollywood is our catwalk. Guys, we're walking to Veggie Grill now because we're hungry. And everybody else is stressed. Maybe they also need to eat. I'm Shlomi. And you work here? Uh, I actually paint here. Wow! <laughs> yeah. yeah, tell us more about that. So yeah, my name work. is Shlomi J, um, aka Shlomi Ayun, Shlomi Joseph Ayun, whatever you guys want to call me. Cool. Um, yeah, I, I paint and uh, I got honored to do the Fallen Legends for the Hollywood Palladium. So it's showing the history from Frank Sinatra, which opened up the Hollywood Palladium back in the 1940s, all the way to who recently passed away, like Avicii, Aretha Franklin. Check it out. 
And to find me, check it out on Instagram, Shlomi J Hayun, S H L O M E underscore J underscore Art. Cool, we put a link in the description of the video. Thank right you so here. much. Yes, right here. <laughs> and also in the description so everybody can copy paste exactly. it and click on it. Thank you so yes, much. Nice to meet you. Yeah, sure, hug, oh. whatever, we do it all. Alright, so you guys saw David Bowie. We'll show you a few more of these. It was so cool that we saw the artist. These are amazing. I like hearing a little bit of history about it too. This guy is here. There's veggie grill, our favorite food. Hey guys, in the background you can see some of our next destinations. There's Amoeba Music and the Dome, the Arclight Dome Cinema and Veggie Grill. We first need to go to Veggie Grill before Alison is gonna die of starvation and me too. Not yet. Later, maybe. We're standing now in front of Veggie Grill. I'm so starving. I'm like, I'm ready to eat. One of the best places to go, Veggie Grill. Yeah, best <laughs> vegan food in LA, guys. Look, can you see it? Oops, I want the letters. No, I screwed it. Wait, I want the letters. <laughs> it's up there, guys, Veggie Grill. And look, look, that, oh, that's what Alison looks like, and that's what the burgers look like. You know what, guys? That's a veggie. Can you see that? <laughs> We're gonna eat it now. My food already arrived. This is not fair. I almost died of starvation and I'm still on the fry. Yeah, you can <laughs> fry. I won't let you starve. <laughs> you never let your friends starve, guys. <laughs> so I ordered the Beyond the Tacos. They do seasonal menus here, so you never know what's going to be in here when you get here until you look at the seasonal menu, so I'm trying something new. <laughs> Hopefully soon. Cool. Yeah, I hope it's going to come soon. Aww, look at that! That was cool! We got carrot cake for free! Magic with carrot cake! Yeah! Never had it before either. And we got it on the house! Because we're telling you guys something nice about this place, but it's one of my favorite places to eat. Yours too, right? Oh my gosh, I've been coming here for years and years. There's one down at Laurel Canyon, Crescent Heights, that I used to always go to. And then when this one opened, it's even better because it's closer. Yeah, this is my favorite one. And guys, I have to tell you something. Oh, uh, the bikini store? Yes. Okay. Guys, I'm just trying to get in better shape because I got offered a job as a bikini model. But you know what? Sometimes <laughs> you just have to accept the fact that you can still look fabulous even with a few pounds more. Maybe I can tell them I'm just doing the upper part right now. Let's see. Now we're gonna enjoy the food. You are. Yes, I'm <laughs> waiting for you, of course. I'm dying. Do you want to tell them what happened? Okay. So again, I think I've said on here twice, I'm starving. Third time, I am starving. I have not eaten anything except for a granola bar and a smoothie. I normally have breakfast and lunch by now. And Katie's so sweet. Her food's been sitting here for over 10 minutes without my food. And I finally just went and asked. I was like, why does it take so long? And they told me that they, I don't understand how, but somehow they didn't know I ordered. I looked at the guy in the eyes. I told him what I wanted. Katie paid for it. Thank you, Katie. Yes. And then they never brought my food. I'm gonna die. Uh, but you can still have some fries. <laughs> I've been eating your fries. Oh, we can. I don't ever eat fries. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm eating another fry. No, we have to add the mayo. Oh, but I have to say this too to redeem Veggie Girl. They told me they're giving me my food for free and they're making it a combo. Yes. So we still love the Veggie Girl. I'm just about yes. to die of starvation. We always love the Veggie Girl. <laughs> Things like this can happen. We're yes, but they and made we have fries. Look, guys, we have sweet potato fries. These are sweet potato fries, my favorites. And I have always 
an additional mayo with them because I need to drown everything in mayo. As a future bikini model, I guess. <laughs> That's the diet. The model diet right there. Sure. Mm. I never have too much mayo. <laughs> Very French. Mm -hmm. That's what French do. Mm -hmm. Mayo, fries. I've never actually had a sweet potato fry with mayonnaise. I can honestly oh. say that. Do you want should I do it? Not the first time ever. You should. What do you you say? should. Look. <laughs> I will hold it so that everybody can see it. Oh, thank you. Wow, it looks good. <laughs> and my food just came, thank God. But here we go. Yes. And do you like it? Do you want to become a bikini model too now? I'll eat a few more and I'll become a bikini model. Yeah, we can model together. I will let them know. So here's my food. This is crispy taco combo. Oh, it looks very good. And, and I'm going to eat black beans, salsa, rice, chips. Nice. All right, I'm going to pig out. So we're going to turn this off. <laughs> and by the way, this is a Veggie Beyond Burger. It's completely vegan with cheese and vegan meat. Hey guys, I just wanted to show you. This is how my bikini model diet looks. I just ordered a refill on my mayonnaise and my chipotle mayonnaise. Like a good little bikini model, you know? And they gave it to me for free. They always give me refills on all my mayos for free. We are here in front of Amoeba Music. They're one of the few music stores that's still around. One thing they have that's really cool is they have a stage and they do performances inside. They also do sidewalk sales every now and then outside. We can buy super cheap stuff. And recently, I actually found in the very, very back, there's a memorabilia section. It's one of the biggest record stores in Hollywood. And I think even in LA and even in California, right? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Cool. Let's celebrate that. We're famous. <laughs> we can't do that. No, we're not yet. <laughs> We're now at the garage of Amoeba, the entrance. Behind us there's an area where the most famous people in Hollywood have their stickers. And you know, since we're really famous in Hollywood, you know, uh, you will find our stickers there too. Come on, let's go look for it. Let's go look. Let's see, do we find anything metal, babe? Amazon, did you find anything? I see music in every corner right oh, here. Guys! Look at that with all the famous stickers. Oh, wow, music interview corner. And if you scan that, you get to the music interview corner webpage. Oh, look, there's no babe. Oh my god, close to music interview corner. Uh -huh. There's another MVM music sticker right wow. when you walk in the door. So anybody who comes here, we're in the garage. And when you walk in, you'll see this one right here. And you'll see one on the stairs. Uh -huh. Oh, look. There's a metal babe. Horns up Henrietta. Oh, wow, look. And she's wearing a, a metal babe shirt. Isn't uh -huh. that amazing? She is. Oh, oh, I think there's a music too. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, if somebody is as famous as you, uh, you oh, have no. multiple stickers there for sure. Is. Oh my god, and what a good music. place. That's so cool. Wow, yes. How do you feel that you have so many stickers here? I feel famous. <laughs> I mean, of course you are. Hey, Katie, I just found my perfect spot. Check this out MBM Music LLC.com. And I'll show you where I'm gonna put it. So it's always important, sticker etiquette, not to cover up other people's stickers. So I was looking, and I found a spot where I wouldn't cover anything up right here. Okay. Looks really professional. Did you do that often? Of you? If 
Nobody was looking. I don't think it's working. What the heck? Ah, oh, me too. Delete. <laughs> Cool. You know what? I found one that looks a bit worn out, so it will look really like it has been here for a long time. Let's maybe put it here. I think, yeah, that's a free spot. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, maybe like this. <laughs> Too late for that. Dancing in Hollywood, guys. But you can only do that if you're famous. But nobody knows if you're famous or not, so you can do it anyway. I can twist. Woo. I'm gonna twist for you guys. But I don't really know how to do it without the song. Let's twist again. But. Okay. Fabulous. Yeah, guys, we have a very special situation here. You might know it's not always sunny in Philadelphia. It's also not always sunny in LA. Maybe that's why it's called Sunset Boulevard. It's a really cloudy day today. And I wanted to tell you something really nice. Can you see that behind me? This is legal, not only in Hollywood, but in whole California. that looks like a giant golf ball. Do you want to say what it is? Yeah, it's the Cynodome. So if you want to watch a movie on the ceiling and everywhere around 360, yes. you can do it there. Yay! This is LAPD. Look at the real LAPD. Whoa! Oops. LAPD is taking good care of us, guys. Okay. I literally almost just walked into that. Thank God I saw it. <laughs> uh, this is the, the beautiful view of Hollywood. Uh, I mean, uh, I mean, please look at this fountain. Isn't this fountain beautiful? Here's some more beautiful LA for everybody. Wow, guys, isn't that beautiful? <laughs> Abandoned scooter. Any idea why? Do you think aliens abducted him? Do you think a walking dead came and turned him into a zombie? Yes, Alison, I totally think it's possible. In Hollywood, anything is possible. People in LA drive. Look. <laughs> I think he was honking at us. Of course he was. We're famous.
guys, you've seen it before, but behind us is the Palladium, one of the coolest concert venues in Hollywood, the Hollywood Palladium. Yeah. It is. It's, it's a fun venue. I've been there, Katie and I were talking about concerts we've seen there. Yes. And my last one was Marilyn Manson and Rob Zombie. I was right up front. It was crazy. <laughs> That's to be expected. I also saw a really cool show there that when Motley Crue played three songs there and uh, Jackass opened and it was, yeah, it was like it was super awesome. That was like 2004, I think. See Megadot. So yeah, some good shows there for sure. Yeah, and actually I watched my very first concert in LA there and guess what it was? Metal! It was Halloween. Great first show. Oh, and I hope I will go in there very soon to do some interviews. It's, it's planned. Yeah. Look forward to it. You know that what you found on the sticker at Amoeba. Just follow that. I just want to take one shot from the middle of the street. Wow, sunset in the middle of the street. I have to run, guys. Sorry. <laughs> look, look, I almost died. Don't die. I did this shot for you, and you know what? I almost died because the time on the traffic light here it was running out and I almost died for you guys just that you know that that's how much I love you he came back from the dead and we're so happy for him so happy he came back to life <laughs> hopefully he's not one of the walking dead now we don't know for sure do we good thing no. he kept going right <laughs> oh guys look Psychic reading. Should I do it again? No, I guess not. Okay, no, we thank can do you. it, but thank you so much. Really? Look, guys, look how famous we are. Can you say that you're our fans? Uh, no. Hey, can you say you're famous? Uh, you're famous, dog. Oh my famous. god, you guys are stars. We love you. Oh, we love you. Wow, you thank you. I am on MTV. Maybe we can do it from here, or is it dangerous? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> We're almost dying for you guys again. <laughs> exactly. And guys, this is Hollywood. Oh. See? <laughs> this guy almost killed us. Look, this one, this one. Can you see it? No, he. Get his license plate number. <laughs> exactly, he sped off. But we just wanted to say, guys, this is Hollywood Boulevard by night. Look, can you see it? Never got hit by a bus. Now we moved over a few meters to the side. And now, guess what? This is Walk of Fame by night. And we're gonna do it backwards. You ready to try? Backwards? Huh? Yes. Walk yeah. backwards? Yeah, here Look, we go. Can you see the stars? Whoops. We're gonna try. <laughs> We're risking our lives for you again. Risking guys. our lives again, you know. We, we bump into somebody, it could be deadly. Exactly, and two famous girls here from Hollywood. We are risking our lives for you guys because that's how much for we your love you. Entertainment. Exactly. And look, shall we? That meet? one's Blake. Let's, let's write our names on there. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> look. Yeah, there's another Blake one here. We just get our own. Look guys, I don't know if you can see that, but here, look, um, uh, that's actually Alison's and my star. They just didn't get to it to put our names on yet, right? Yeah, they're supposed to come any minute. Exactly. So keep, it, keep waiting for it. Exactly. Yeah. Katie, I'll just write your name on it for you right now. Thank you so much. Here, K-A-T-I. Oh. You have your star. Oh, thank you so much, Alice. My own star. Yes. I will write one for you. Okay, too. now we need one for me. I'm gonna write one for you now. Okay. <laughs> Alison, I am gonna write your star now. I'm a bit nervous. I hope I will not misspell anything. But this one's for you. A L I S O N. Good job. Congratulations on your star, Alison. <laughs> thank you, but let's do metal, babe. Oh yes, of course. We'll do it again. <laughs> okay, okay we're guys, doing. I'm sorry. I didn't even think in that till now. 
<laughs> Erase the star, okay. Okay, let's do it again. <laughs> Alison, the stars for you. M E T A L B A B E. An exclamation mark. That's for you. Are you happy? I'm so happy. Thank you, Katie. Alison, are you happy now? I'm so happy. Aww. Thank you for my star. <laughs> We're sitting for you on the Walk of Fame, next to our stars. Yes, we have stars. our stars. <laughs> and we just realized that Hollywood has so, so much to offer to explore. So we're gonna finish for today, we're gonna stop filming for today, and we're gonna go out another day for you to explore. And we both just got dirty butts for your entertainment. Normally I would not put my butt on Hollywood Boulevard. Yes. So another thing we did. Wow, wow, guys, <laughs> only for you. Look, only for you. Me. Look, 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 it's really on the, on the floor. Can you see that? Wait, I have to do it like this so that people oops, can see that really butts are on the floor. <laughs> my butt is on the floor. Look, oh yeah. And can you see that my butt is on the floor too? Look, you have just... Uh, for you guys, and only for you, and only today, Metal Babe and the future bikini star model <laughs> got their butts on the floor of Hollywood Boulevard. I hope you had fun with that, guys. <laughs> See you I had soon. Fun with it. Oh, me too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you guys soon.
but I claim to recognize me that there I'm famous. There you go, there you go. Can Wait, you show me? Can you, do, can you claim that, that I'm famous and say, like, you're Katie, can I take a picture with you? Can you say that to can me? Can I take a picture? Say it to the camera. Can I take a picture with you? Oh, Katie. Okay. Holy crap, you're Katie? <laughs> Here, do that again. Oh, yeah. Do you want to hug me? Holy crap, you're Katie? Oh, it's so now do that again. Katie. Now do it for us. Yes. Holy crap, you're Katie? Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for yeah. admiring my work. Without you, nothing, nothing of that. Okay, I get possible. my picture, and yes. the dog gets his. Of course. Sprinkles. Oh, beautiful dog. Sprinkles, see Katie. So cute. Wow. Wait a minute, is that really your name? Yes. Oh, okay. Look, without these lovely people, thank you so much. You're welcome. Without these lovely people, none of this, none of this would have been possible. Without these lovely people, I would have never gotten my own star at the Walk of Fame. Yeah. Thank you. I love you all. Oops. Is it very dirty? <laughs> Do you want a butt shot too? Oh, that's my butt. It's my butt. It's dirty, Katie. I think it's okay. It looks okay. Does it look okay? Yeah, it looks okay. Wait, right, I come to you. I think. Yeah, <laughs> it looks. It's wait. It's not too dark. Yeah. It. It looks okay, but uh, it's pretty dark. <laughs> I think our butts passed the test. Yes, and it's dark enough for no one to notice. Because you know, when you're famous, you don't want to walk the walk of fame with a dirty butt. No, really. definitely not. <laughs>